and welcome to my update of my uh, buggy that I made for Unreal and this is a pretty pretty big one update and we will talk about it in this video so first of all let's take a look again the buggy uh, this is the black version I call it Dust Devil and there is a first update that I made uh, basically the roughness of the roughness te texture were uh, completely off so I changed the, that and now we have a proper shading of the model and just like before of course we can detach and touch the turret and we have a desert version of this buggy because it's a desert vehicle but I get the request to make a woodland version so I made one and it will be available as soon as epic upload approved the update and yeah this is the woodland version and yeah if you I don't know many of you send me email asking when the project be updated to add a wooden version so I did it and uh, let's take a closer look first uh, let's, uh, this model this was a hard model to achieve just because all of the shocks are working and sometimes in modeling and developing this model I just wanted to I don't know to bury it but I made, made it working and when it released on the marketplace I I got uh, a lot of feedback about uh, buggy just skidding around and I didn't quite understand why because I played it a lot and my project always behave like it should but I got a lot of requests that is skidding and around and actually if we take a look if we take a look uh, at we have a uh, I know three and a half stars and yeah, it, it's painful for me guys come on I just wanted four stars I know it's a perfect but I hope that with this update I will achieve at least half star so yeah I got a lot of demand asking why it's skinning and the problem was I will explain shortly we have uh, this config tire I use the old version of the 4.16 engine and it working but uh, I don't know sometimes I pick up the edit or I forgot to put it in the tires so there was no friction and buggy was just spinning around but in my version this was plugged correctly but I fixed that now the buggy is uh, correctly will not skid away not not uh, basically it will behave just uh, uh, better and yeah I hope that someone someone of you buy this project and uh, find it irritating and give me negative feedback that you you will find in your heart to correct and maybe maybe I can achieve that half star on the review in the marketplace so I can have a four star and uh, another request let's just delete all of them and leave just one another another function that is highly requested is, is uh, pitch invert so I'm with this project and I will update all my future project there is under the use menu you have a use invert pitch so if you check this on and off you will find pitch inverted so uh, normal pitch inverted pitch I know which pitch you guys like to use so you have option to use it uh, any way you want it and yeah that was a request by many people and I think just by that request that uh, uh, my rating is so low on the marketplace for this project and I hope that uh, with this update I will correct that now just like before we can uh, turn skins just by clicking on this desert skin, woodland skin and dust devil skin I repeat woodland skin is 
add it with this version and I hope that it will be updated on the on the marketplace soon of course uh, we can uh, hide and unhide turret to be just like a human buggy and add the return now let's take it for a spin and just take the drive and yeah I also also update the HUD elements on the buggy and yeah don't not skid away uh, we have a walking gauges we have a uh, fully walking shocks and depth suspensions those shocks were a nightmare to achieve the walk and let's take it off all Yeah, we have a working particles effect. I didn't use this particle effect in the past because my card was suffering. I don't know what is wrong with that. Sometimes they just bugged out and particle effects hit performance really, really hard. But now it's working. So yeah, the buggy is pretty powerful to climb anywhere, almost anywhere. Just a like a real one. We have uh, also particle effects when we hit something because it's uh, so low beneath the ground. Sometimes we'll hit something. And we have a cockpit camera, of course. Uh, let's take for a ride here. And this map is included in the in the project. You can find it under maps and demonstration. We have a walking light of course, each light can be destroyed separately, the, we have an interior lighting and we have a back indicators for the brake light. And I ch changed some physics on the buggy, so it, uh, it has a uh, more power and it's more responsive. And it will not, I will be, it will not skid away. We were pretty, pretty going fast. Yeah, just like in real, real life, you can accept some skidding, but not nothing like uh, uh, not nothing like uh, before how the friction now is correct now let's take the shooting range okay. and just to say if you invert the pitch the pitch will be also inverted in the turret so another thing that I changed is actually camera shake uh, I know what was uh, I think before the camera shake was pretty well, was heavy. I don't know how to say it now. And I slightly tweaked the projectile spawn location. I will be uh, previous version was slightly off the center. Now it, it's dead center. And we have a zoom in zoom out function. So We have a slightly less camera shape, and I add some uh, overheating effects. You can change and tweak the overheating directly from the blueprint uh, how long it's 
take to machine gun to be overheated and how long it takes to be cooled down and yeah this was quick update for my buggy uh, I don't know if I forget something I said about the pitch and I said about the the, the skins and it, I don't know I hope that some of you if you use this project you will update your rating to the marketplace and help me to achieve at least four stars I will, I will be pretty happy with the four stars I know some of my projects are not perfect oh we have a bug there uh, some of my projects are not perfect but I'm trying to make them I'm trying to improve them and every update I hoping that I will do that so yeah guys thank you thank you very much and see you in the next video